Hello everybody, my name is Pete <coughs> Dub, and let me not waste your time. So, today I'm going to be talking about a free plugin that you can use for DaVinci Resolve that is totally safe, it is perfectly usable, and I've used it for a long time, as long as my friends, and definitely recommend it. So, in the first link in the description, there should be a link to this website, stakeunderwater.com. Uh, and it's basically called reactor which is the plugin so you'll get to this page and you want to scroll down to this right here the reactor.installer.lua so just click that and then install this file right here and once you install that file you just want to open up davinci resolve go into the fusion tab and then from your file explorer just drag it in here and there should be a pop-up prompt to install the lua file which a lua file is basically just an installer for davinci resolve um, like this plugin or other stuff, but that's what it's being used for here. So just go through the setup process. It'll ask you where you want to save it and anywhere else like that. The options, uh, after it's done installing, a screen should pop up, but if you close it or you want to open it again, I'm going to show you how now. So you want to go up to workspace, go down to scripts, reactor, open reactor. Once you click this, it will update and then reactor will open. So this is the plugin called Reactor for Fusion. And basically what it is, is it is a database of effects or plugins, I guess you could say for DaVinci Resolve that are all free. And how it works, I will show you right now. So let's say you wanna find a certain plugin here. You can search and look up Glow. I have XGlow already downloaded, but let's say you want uh, Fast Expo Glow. You can click on it right here just to see the details of it and anything else that's kind of interesting about it and it'll show the installed files so this one is a macro for blur and it's fast exponential glow so you can click the little check mark here or click install i like clicking the check mark and it will say you can have a suggested donation link to the author of the plugin so you can either say shut up and take my money which is basically to go to their donation link or just say not right now but consider it after you say not right now, it will install and that's all you need to do. So you can do that with as many things here that you want. There's a lot of different effects you can see. I'm going to scroll down real quick. These are all things you can download. Some are broken and won't work and some require you to have the studio version. But for the most part, you can get a lot of different plugins and useful scripts for DaVinci Resolve. So once you have it downloaded, you just want to close out of here. And then it says new items have been installed you may need to restart fusion so some plugins will require you to close davinci reopen the project and you'll be able to find them but we can see now if you go control or shift space and then type in expo right here we'll have our fast expo glow all right and what this allows you to do is basically once you drag in the node it acts as a plugin i guess you could say in effect and it'll have custom options here that you can adjust so this is the gain this is the glow radius this is the range of the different glows that you can have as you can see right here and then there's just a ton of different options that you can play around with here it'll be different for every effect so just go around if you need something look it up in reactor and see if there's something you can use that's pretty much all for this video. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed. If you like this video, please drop a like on the video and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more stuff like this because I will keep up the frequent uploads and I really want to hit 1k by the end of this year. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if there's any questions you have, please leave them in the comments or in my Discord server, a link in the description. And as always, I will see you guys next time. Later.